first of all, I'd like to thank the Federal Minister, uh, Dr. Zafar Mirza, that by coming over here, owning up this uh, very successful conference and workshop, it actually indicates that the government is on the same page and they are making a tremendous effort to ensure that not only we are going to work very hard towards prevention of this disease, we are also going to work very hard, God forbid, if there is an outbreak. Uh, I'm extremely grateful to uh, Captain Usman and his team, our Secretary Hill, who has made a tremendous effort uh, in organizing this conference, and I think it has been extremely successful. Um, very rarely do you see in a scientific conference of all this number of people sitting together and um, talking to each other, consulting each other, and then coming up with very good recommendations. I think, again, the credit goes to Usman for constantly monitoring there, just by his being present throughout these last two days, of this exhaustive consultative process, he has ensured that we get the best out of it. I think the coming of our uh, foreign delegates, particularly from all those countries like Ceylon, and Sri Lanka, Malaysia, Singapore, uh, from Vietnam, and then from Thailand, it's been a pleasure to have you all here. Uh, if I haven't named, I think I'm missing a country, but if I'm missing a country from Canada also, just by coming here and participating, I think it's been an extremely, extremely uh, productive sort of a session. The thing is, just, as we said, dengue has absolutely no borders. All countries have been suffering from this. And people who've come in as international delegates have a long, a very long experience behind them how to deal and manage this condition sharing it with us, because every country will have some of its own problems, and therefore sharing it has resulted in a very comprehensive uh, program coming up. And the recommendations which have been given to us, I've told Dr. Zafar Mirza that we'll be sending him a detailed report. Um, I was particularly in, impressed by the Volvaki uh, bacteria, which was mentioned, particularly it's used in Australia and used in South America. We were very keen to find out new innovative ideas, what all can we do about it. Um, so all the things which came up, I think, have been have become, given a very, very important um, input to us how to manage, how to deal, and how to prevent the condition. Uh, when we talk about prevention, we say that the prevention is the most important thing. And the most important thing is that today, in this room, the people who are listening to the mind, who are about 300, are at least one lesson to leke jayenge yahan se ke hamare liye kitna ahem hai ke iske upar hum kaam kare aur logo mein ye message phailaye ke ye dengue jo hai ye endemic hai pakistan mein ye maujood hai ab iske khilaf humne kis tarah kaam karna hai taaki ye ho na to jo preventive measures hain aur unke upar baar baar jo hum emphasize kar rahe the mass awareness aapko pata hai ke pehle bhi maine zikr kiya ke mass awareness ka बहुत बड़ा रोल होता है लोगों को अगर पता ही चल जाए तो लोग खुद हिफाजती तदाबीर इख्तियार कर सकते हैं हमें मीडिया की स्ट्रेटजी बनानी पड़ेगी लोगों को पता होना चाहिए आ, सवाल उठते हैं कई दफ़ा हमारे लिए कि आप लोगों ने स्प्रे नहीं की और मैं कल बड़ी खुश हुई सुन के ये रिमार्क मुझे पहुँचाया गया कि वन ऑफ आर एमिन स्पीकर से स्प्रे इज जस्ट आई वॉश बेसिकली डज नो गुड Frankly speaking, what we need to do is destroy the tanky lava. So the thing is this, we make, need to make people understand how important it is. We have come a long way from 2011 outbreak um, in which we lost more than 325 people. I was extremely impressed when I went into Holy Family Hospital because they had faced a number of dengue epidemics. Uh, they were very well equipped, well trained, and the best part was they already had high dependency units. They knew exactly what has to be done. I was very happy when Usman came in and his major focus was to arrange for Dextron to see that if we need Dextron, we should be having it. So basically people now know more about the disease over the last so many years. But this time facing that epidemic, which was a part of an international epidemic, majority of the country suffered because of it. I think uh, learning from each other's experience 
I'm hopeful that, inshallah, year 2020, we'll be able to control the situation in a far better fashion. In lafzo ke saath, bhoat lamba din guzra hai. Aap sab ki mein bhoat zada shukar guzar hoon. Mein khas toor pe apne international delegates ki. I'm particularly very thankful to my international delegates that you participated so well and so fully in everything. And I hope you enjoyed your stay in Lahore. And I think you had a nice evening yesterday when you went and saw Lahore in the evening. Lahore is a very, very old city. It's got a very long history behind it. And we always believe that this is a city of culinary arts. So I hope you enjoyed your stay here. But we're very grateful and hopefully, inshallah, we'll continue this uh, constant exchange of information between all our countries and ensure that whatever documents that we develop, we share them with everyone because it would always be a help. With these words, I'm again very grateful to everybody who participated, particularly Dr. Zafar Mirza for his coming over and listening to our recommendations. And we'll inshallah prepare a report. Already Usman has started preparing a report. You've seen what he already has all the details from it. And once we prepare the report, we'll send you the report along with all our recommendations and what we are going to do with these words. Thank you very much again. Uh, whatever time you have now left in Pakistan, please enjoy yourself, particularly the international delegates. So thank you for working so hard. It was a pleasure to have you all here. Pakistan, Zindabad.